previously on The Walking Dead. I know who you are. Oh, I got shit. another good one for you. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug. You got it, boss. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. <laughs> Oh my god. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was gonna take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Not enough. According to Lily, we've just about hit the last of our food reserves. Some people might have to go without tonight. You mean Lily's lottery again? Kenny's gonna be pissed. She thinks everyone should have an equal chance of missing a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. He's got a wife and son to look out for. And they're safest in a big group. Going out on his own will get them all killed. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. He thinks I'm a danger to the group, and Clementine. I think he's the one putting us in danger. The way Lily worries about his health, I wouldn't be surprised if she's been skimming rations for him. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. It's a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. Ah! Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! Ah! <laughs> 
Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. No, no. Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off. Get it off. God damn it. Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not going to hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Please, this is fucked up. We've gotta help you. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. We gotta get him out of there. Oh, God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. Hurry, please, hurry. Lee, this trap has been altered. There's no release latch. Oh no. Shit, walkers! It's now or never, Lee. Please! Get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. This is bad. Mm. Do something to cut you out. No, no, no! Try the trap again! Anything, please! Try to cut the chain! Please! Get me out of this! Okay, ich kann es auch nochmal anders versuchen. Let's go, let's go! <lacht> Entschuldigung. Hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück zu Walking Dead übrigens. Hurry. Episode 2! Da musste jetzt einfach mal durch den Pain durch. Ich glaube, das geht nicht. Oh god, there's so many of them! Ja, ne? <lacht> Alter! Oh god! He passed out. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on, we gotta move! The gate's open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! Oh my god! 
What happened? Oh, God. Ow, Ow, what's hey, going on? I have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. He would have died if we left him. So what? We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group, right here, right now. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? You think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food. But nobody else wants to. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Oh weia. Gut, dann sage ich nochmal Hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück äh, zu The Walking Dead. Episode 2, Hunger und Hilfe oder auf Englisch, ich habe keine Ahnung. Hunger and Help, ne keine Ahnung wie es heißt. Ihr werdet es im Titel sehen. Ja, ähm, drei Monate sind vergangen. Krass, krass, krass. Hatte ich jetzt selber gar nicht mehr im Kopf, dass so ein Zeitsprung hier zwischen ist. Damn board steady? I'm trying, I, I didn't realize I was getting this week already. What do you want, a handout? Uh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up, quit being such a pansy. Ich glaube, Geld, Geld bringt in dieser Welt nichts mehr. Ich will mal eben. Mir kommt gerade der Sound so laut vor irgendwie. Ich werde mal ein bisschen leiser machen. Vielleicht war es in der ersten Episode auch schon so. Aber egal. <lacht> Jetzt einmal ein bisschen leiser zumindest. So. Ähm, ja, jetzt können wir uns mal mit allerlei Leuten unterhalten. Machen wir natürlich auch. Lily thinks we should throw these new people out. Damn right. There's too many people hanging around here as it is. You've got to talk to Lily about getting along with Kenny. Lily can make her own friends. It's not about making friends. We're all in this together. We got to start acting like it. Stuff all that. We'd be fine without you. Arsch. Du kriegst kein Essen von mir. Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? 
Come on, Larry, give it a rest. I'm sure Lee is getting pretty sick of you thinking he's a danger to the group. Is that what you told him? Yeah, that's right. And what are you gonna do about it? Look, I don't care what it is, but you two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. Oh boy, can't even give him the You holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there, having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah, I just hope Kanja can save him. <laughs> Lily's pretty pissed at us. Listen, I know her intentions are good, but but nothing. She's making the smart choice. Those parasites you guys brought back need to go. Can somebody fresse halten? <laughs> you ever miss the Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. Well, good luck with that wall. We'll get it. It's like a Game of Thrones spiel. The wall. Ha 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 ha! Okay, um, next station. We're going to go against the Uhrzeiger. I can't go faster. It's is belastend. So, how does it look here on the... Beine reparieren, Front aus. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Surely. Uh... Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. Hmm. I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. The right thing is just scary sometimes, I guess. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check gedrückt. in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Okay. Mm. So viele Peoples here. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. Thank I've you. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. <laughs> Die so richtig motiviert. Gut, wäre ich in der Situation wahrscheinlich auch nicht so. Hey, is my friend gonna make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There was no other way. Hmm. So who are you people? Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The man you saved is Mr. Parker, the band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when... when everything happened. How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of, I don't know, something. Hmm. I'm sure you did all you could. Yeah, maybe. Relax. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. Du kriegst kein Essen von mir. Noch nicht. Vielleicht. Mal gucken. Oops. How you doing, Clementine? Everything all right? Yeah. Is that man going to be okay? I'm not sure. I hope he will. I'm so hungry, Lee. I hope I get to eat soon. Vielleicht können wir ihn ja essen, wenn's, äh... Wenn's... Wenn's knapp wird. Ich hatte noch eine, genau, ich hatte auch noch eine Sprachoption hier. That thing doesn't work anymore, does it? No, not since it broke at the drugstore. Just gonna hold on to it then? Yeah, if that's okay. I, um, I need it. It's okay, hon. You said you didn't think they would find us. Well, yeah, but 
That's just because... But we can try to find them. Look, uh, mm. Clementine. I'm not stupid, Lee. I know it's just pretend. But it makes me feel better. Okay, you take good care of it then. Ja, ja, in dieser Welt muss I man will. schnell erwachsen werden. Dramatisch. Are you okay over here? Uh huh, I'll be okay. Komischer Junge, der hätte sterben sollen. Ähm. How you doing, Doug? I'm okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is? I don't know. A dog? Nope. Oh, I know. It's a goat, right? No. Oof. You were pretty brave when we brought those people in here. That's because I know Mom can fix him. Ah, yeah. Catch you later, Doug. Bye, Lee. Ketchup later. Erstmal Mayonnaise. Hmm. Sleeping any better? No. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. Drugstore? Yeah. Lily has me handing out the food. Ugh. That can't be an easy job. It's not. I won't be able to feed everyone. What should I do? Well, if you wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food, even though that guy can be a real dick sometimes. On the other hand, giving that food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you, if he decides to take off in that RV one day. What about you? You need food too. We all need food. I can't tell you what to do, but whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to do the right thing. Gut, sie wird nicht sauer sein, wenn ich ihr kein Essen gebe, deswegen gebe ich ihr kein Essen. So, äh, ja, ich habe schon so ein paar Kandidaten auf jeden Fall. Aber erstmal reden wir mit allen, ganz entspannt. Words getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. Hmm. Das mit der Küste ist einer guten Idee. Ah ja. We need you here. We have a better chance of surviving as a group. Our best chance of surviving is to get away from the mainland. My mind is made up. Okay, Bruder, kriegst halt kein Essen von mir. Okay, mm, <lacht> Natürliche Auslese nennt man das. Warum ist man so langsam? Ich wünsche, es geht mit Sprint-Button. Vielleicht gibt es den nicht einfach nur zu doof, gerade den zu finden. Aber ich habe eigentlich alle Tasten, die existieren, einmal gedrückt. Fußball. Okay, haben wir jetzt tatsächlich mit eingequatscht? Ja, ist ja funny. Ich habe auf jeden Fall, ähm, ja gut, dann verteile ich mal Essen, würde ich sagen. Ich meine, zwei Leute, die Essen kriegen, dürfte selbstverständlich sein, oder? Die Kinners. So. Hey, Clem, you need something to eat. Äh, oh, äh, äh, Nein, gibt es nicht vier Optionen? Hm. Hier komm. Okay, a Sunday would be better next time. <lacht> I'll keep that in mind. If you have any more food, Duck is hungry too. Yeah, why don't we then get some food? Es ist noch dreimal was zu essen da. Was zu essen? Ich glaube, das Essen wird dann groß geschrieben. Aber egal. Äh, ja, genau. Du bist hey, kackend. How about a little food? Wie er guckt. Du kriegst irgendeinen Schrott. Du kriegst... Ja, doch, du kriegst auch. Ja! Yeah. Oh man, I'm so hungry! Kann ja ein bisschen teilen mit Vater und Mutter. So, komm, und ich glaube, wie ich werde es tun, ich werde jetzt dem alten Sack was geben. Weil er halt ein alter Sack ist, weißt du? Ich denke ja, rational, Kinder und äh, Rentner zuerst, wobei Rentner, keine Ahnung, die sterben eh bald. Egal, aber das hat dann auch den netten Nebeneffekt, dass er uns vielleicht ein bisschen mag, genau wie Lilly, von daher gehen wir es einfach mal an. Ich habe mir die Mauer gar nicht angeguckt. It keeps the walkers out. Carly's been doing the bulk of the lookout duty. Joa. Okay, äh, ja, komm. <lacht> Here, Larry. 
Well, he would want you to keep your strength up. I should shove this up your ass, but I'm too hungry. <laughs> du hast eine schwere Entscheidung getroffen. Oh, man, just seeing the food is driving me crazy. Tut mir leid, Bruder. So, behalte das letzte Nahrung. Gibt er? Nee, gibt das, das letzte Nahrung. Ja, das letzte Nahrung. Mhm. Oh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Ich bin ein starker Mann. Und ich bin schwarz. Ich bin schon. Ich habe schon viel Scheiße erlebt. So. <lacht> Wen gebe ich denn jetzt? Oh, ich habe keine Ahnung. Äh, wo ist Lilly eigentlich? Ach, da oben. Ah, guck mal. Ich habe gar nicht mit ihr geredet. We should talk about you and Kenny. What about us? They're arguing. It's getting pretty out of hand. You know people notice that. Look, I'm working my ass off to make sure we have a good setup here and Kenny just doesn't appreciate that. All we need is food. But there is no food. You know that better than anyone. Well, we'll just have to find some. Maybe we should think about leaving the motel. God, not you too. I know Kenny wants to leave. I think that's why he's so eager to get the RV working. But this is a good spot. We're protected, we're close to the drugstore, we have a routine now and it's working. For now. Keep an eye out. Fine. Wem gebe ich jetzt das letzte Essen? Ich bin echt ein bisschen unsicher. Ich meine, er ist eigentlich schon dankbar mit der Familie. Die hauen eh bald ab, da finden sie eh ganz viel Essen. Fein. Gebe ich dem Neuankömmling hier was? Dem Loser? Ach, irgendwie, der hatte bestimmt gerade erst was. Der hatte bestimmt gerade erst was. Und bald essen wir ja auch ihn, also von daher ist das ja egal. Und ich glaube tatsächlich, ich gebe Kali einfach was zu essen. Was es nicht daran liegt, dass ich mich an sie ranmachen will oder so. <lacht> Und einfach, ich weiß nicht, irgendwie, keine Ahnung. Fühle ich es oder so. Oder? Oder ihr. Nee, die ist zu bitchig. Und ich habe schon Larry was gegeben. Mal Larry. Von daher passt das schon. Ähm. Kann ich ne. Es wäre lustig, wenn ich einfach nochmal was zu essen geben könnte. Na komm. Was soll's. Want something to eat? Have an apple, Carly. God, I used to eat an apple every morning with some granola and six almonds, and that wasn't enough even then. But you know what? Yes. Disgusting Frühstück. Nee, geht so. <lacht> Bin ja nicht so der Müsli-Fan. Ich habe jetzt tatsächlich Müsli gefunden, was ich ganz geil finde. Ich glaube, weil es ungesund ist. Deswegen. Not such an easy job, is it? I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee, Kenny, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice, but you took care of the kids. That's what a real man does. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... What's his problem? Don't be like that, Lee. I know we've all seen death, but that doesn't make it any easier. That man you brought, I tried. But he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? Das habe ich nicht erwartet. Ich wollte gerade überlegen, okay, was kann ich dir nicht mal erzählen? Geht schon los. Ging ganz schön schnell. Den linker Stick, ich benutze den linker Stick. You okay? Yeah. 
Thanks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. What? We're all infected? Everyone? I... I guess so. I don't know. I... All I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we, we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Mm. We don't want any trouble. Of course, uh, n neither do we. Uh, I'm Andy St. John. This here's my brother Dan. We're just out looking for gasoline. Looks like you folks got the motel locked down, which, which is fine, but uh, if you could spare any gas, well, we'd be much obliged. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out, see if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what do y'all think? You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Hmm. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I lied to her, but... What exactly did happen with the senator? It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years, I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? <laughs> mm. We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Uh. Nine, including the kids. You Nixon. forgot Ben. Me? That makes it ten. Well, we'd love <laughs> to get you all out to the dairy. 
Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. And are. you guys were keeping it there's all There's only two of them. Oh, no. There's yeah, you know what? We ate it all. What are you going to fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out. And hope they move on. Fuck you! <laughs> Jesus! Asshole! The world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Oh boy! Ich fand deren Soundqualität sehr lustig. Die war irgendwie voll schlecht. <lacht> Hört sich ein bisschen an wie Ihr geht hier aus der Das ist keine Katzen ist. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. This is a really brilliant setup. Suits us just fine. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farmhands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Uh... We all work together. We got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybell will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Hmm. Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but 
Maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. Alright, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Also die kaputte Schaukel ist auf jeden Fall schon das gefährlichste hier in der gesamten Welt, muss ich tatsächlich sagen. Das gehört sich nicht! Das ist nicht nach Fortschrift gebaut worden. Deswegen ist George auch nicht in der EU. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. Mind if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the sea and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. <lacht> ich finde schön, dass ich die Axt die ganze Zeit im Inventar habe. Vielleicht köpfe ich den Typen hier einfach mal. Sankt John. Ach ja. Mm, Mark. Hey Mark, wer ist der Gutste hier? So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. Da war ja ein äh, spannendes Gespräch. Na gut, erstmal alles beobachten hier. Ich bin quasi der TÜV gerade und gucke, ob hier alles fortschriftsgemäß sicher gebaut wurde. Hmm. Hmm. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. Maybe the hose has gesteckt das Brett. Jetzt brauche ich noch ein Seil. Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. Yep, can't take any chances when it comes to safety. Gut, Kollege Schnürschuh, dann rede ich mal mit dir. Was hast du mir zu sagen? Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? Hmm. Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully, it'll never come to that, but thanks. Ha! It's all empty walk. Oh, so this is all. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers. Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots. And we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. You know? Like us. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Hmm. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. What's up with you telling him what I said about him thinking I'm dangerous? Look, you said it. You even admitted it right to him. 
Hmm. I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. There's one. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Yeah. Who do you think he was? Maybe a farmhand. I don't know. I hope he wasn't like this long before the fence finished him off. Yeah. Hmm, that doesn't just eat. <laughs> Looks like he's stuck. Disgusting. Okay. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. Can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Hey. The fortress needs people to defend it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. These folks are just delaying the inevitable. This place is gonna fall apart, just like everywhere else. <sighs> Maybe you're right. There's another one. I see. Nihilismus. Ich habe keine Hoffnung mehr. Der sieht ja lustig aus, wie der hier so. So, er hat's. Oder sie hat's noch weit geschafft. Ich erkenne Hot Pants, deswegen äh, habe ich das Gender mal einfach assumed. Mmm. Ist ja wie in. Äh you never get used to the smell, do you? <lacht> nope. Am besten nichts Neues in dieser 70er Verfilmung. Das ist die einzige Szene, an die mich erinnern kann. Can't stop thinking about dinner. Da auch irgendjemand in den Zaun und sind nur die Hände dran. Get some of those rations. I get hungry too, you know. Mm. We'll go ask for more to eat after this is done. All right, I can suck it up. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <lacht> oh oh. Er ist außerhalb des Safe Spaces. Hm. <lacht> button mashing, button mashing. Was das gerade drin? What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. What the? Get to the gate. Get down. You asshole. Jesus. We had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on, that gate is our only way out. Uh-oh. Uh. I got one of you. No fuel. Of course. Na ehrlich. Ah, oder so. Ist da noch irgendwas Tolles? Ich kann das Ding abklemmen, damit es ein bisschen besser funktioniert. Come on. We can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! Shit! Reich im Schutz des Traktors das Tor. Also Kollege Schnürschuh da, der coolste hier, Mark, der coolste hier, der äh... Sieht auf jeden Fall schon ein bisschen dumm. What happened? Shit! It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move it. Na toll. Äh... Interessant, dass sie nicht mal ein bisschen näher kommen. 
Und die ganze Zeit da hinten im Baum, im Baum chillen, in den Bäumen. Eine Menge. Drei, um genau zu sein. Musste ja auch nochmal passieren. Entspannen Sie sich! Oh. Hallo! Na? Hm. Ähm. Oh! Ich hätte irgendwas tun sollen, was ich nicht gesehen habe. Gut! Kann ich das? Ah, kann ich nicht Weg mit dir! Es ist die Maus die ganze Zeit im Bild, ist das? Oh, und auseinanderreißen! Klatsch! Muss ich jetzt irgendwas tun? Oder muss ich einfach nur gleich irgendwo anders hinrennen? out there holy shit are, are you okay bandits here on our property oh my lord what happened to you sweetheart it was those bastards in the woods mama yeah i'll be all right once it's out god damn it hurts hey y'all mark oh my god what happened he got shot with an arrow christ are you gonna be okay yeah i'm fine i should just pull it out oh no honey come on brenda's got you come on inside now We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. <sighs> So much for your deal. Those oh, shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were gonna give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope you kids like swings. A swing. I love swings. Just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. 
Ich wollte die reparieren. Habe ich das tatsächlich verkackt oder hätte ich das nicht machen können? Ich weiß es nicht. Na naja, gut. Dann, ähm, oh, hi. Ich hoffe, das Kind fällt runter und stirbt. Ja. Ähm. Ich muss mal schnell sein, um damit zu interagieren. Ich hoffe, ich habe getroffen. Wow, danke dafür. Hallo, Clementine. Hey, Clem. Do you like the swing? Ich wollte doch deinen Hut suchen. Yeah, it's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. <sighs> hmm. How are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? He got lucky out there. It would have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Well, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. <laughs> what do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Hmm. <laughs> not sure, Clem. I hope so. I hope so, too. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me, too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Of course. It's all yours. Yeah! Okay, Duck, don't pop a gasket. Thanks for pushing me, sagte der Drogenabhängige zu seinem Dealer. Okay, kann ich hier noch irgendwie, keine Ahnung, mit ihm schnacken? Schnacken, das ist auch ein schönes Wort, ne? Hey. Hey, Lee. <lacht> hey. anything interesting? I'm just trying to make sure this place is secure. In case we decide to make this a more long-term solution. Except for those people in the woods. Seems pretty safe. Good to know. Keep your ears open for anything else that might help us. <laughs> How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? Did Duck and Katja get here okay? No, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. I hope you're right. Duck and Clementine deserve a better life than starving to death at some crappy motel. I guess, uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here? I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch him go hungry. You're with me on this, right? <laughs> You're not making me pick sides, Kenny. Well, you better think about it, because that time is coming. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Okay, boss. Also, nicht boss. Also, ne? Ihr wisst schon. <laughs> Demokratie. Mit allen Mitteln. Manchmal muss man mit Demo Demokratie auch mit Gewalt durchsetzen, ne? Ist halt so. So. Ähm, ganz wie Benzin. Vatergrad. Nee. You can definitely tell they built this thing themselves. Hm. Der TÜV ist nämlich nicht zufrieden damit. Ha, huh, ich kann da hingehen. <lacht> Danke. Uh. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Ja. Ja, ich sehe wie nur der lächerliche Zaun. Ui. <lacht> Spitz. Ähm, da hinten sind die Leute. Ich kann da schon. Ja, ich kann da. Dann ist da wahrscheinlich der optionale Ort, dann gehe ich da halt erstmal hin. Behaupte ich jetzt mal. Pro Engine Generator. Kann ich auch rein? Eieiei. 
weil ich mir alles angucken kann. Lots of hay. Hey. Enough of these might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. Hm. Ist hier Wände. Ist hier was drin? Ach, da kümmert sich wahrscheinlich gerade. Ich habe Raum in der Haus für alle von uns. Ich denke, ein paar von uns könnten hier hier in Schiffs campen. Okay, ich darf hier gar nicht rein. If there's not enough nee. room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here. Ich kann die Dialoge nicht skippen, das ist schon ein bisschen nervig. Ach komm, ich gehe jetzt nicht mit jedem Scheiß, aber mit den Leuten. Die sind nämlich kein Scheiß, außer er. Er ist schon ein bisschen Scheiß, aber. Ja. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? I'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? Sie und Kenny haben Frieden nicht gemacht. Was? I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything. But gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Hey, thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? <laughs> Kenny believes there's still hope. Maybe that's what we need right now. Well, hope doesn't do any good if we're all dead. I'm focused on keeping us alive. Hey. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Hmm. How do you put up with him? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much, and lost... pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. Don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. Respectable, auf jeden Fall. Think our little arrangement with them was a good idea? A little late to be asking that now, don't you think? Dad's right. Let's just wait for dinner. And then if Mark is feeling up to it, we leave. I don't want to push our luck here. Now, now, let's not be hasty. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. Also, ihm gefällt es hier auf jeden Fall schon. Das, das, das ist doch schon mal, das ist doch schon mal was. Der alte Sack hat richtig Bock hier auf den Laden. Na gut, äh, ja, gucken wir nochmal, ob ich jetzt noch mit irgendwem hier quatschen kann. Unmittelbar, aber ich glaube nicht, ne, ne, ich war ja überall. Dann können wir ja jetzt mal aufbrechen in Richtung Haus und das da mal ein bisschen angucken. Sofern das jetzt die Sache ist. Oder ob wir jetzt erstmal losziehen und ein paar Banditen schlachten. Wahrscheinlich letzteres eher. Fellas, how you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. We should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Not good. Yeah. 
It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. Found it. Okay. Schleiche ins Lager. Ich gebe mein Bestes. Ich kann übrigens nur gerade auslaufen, <lacht> nicht mal zur Seite. You see anybody? Hmm. Can't tell. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. Too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Also so offen im Wald ist halt auch eigentlich ein bisschen dämlich, oder? Da müssen die nicht schon längst zerpflückt worden sein. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these. Recently. Würde ich mitnehmen. Vielleicht sind da noch irgendwie, weiß ich nicht, Reste drin. Nothing but fumes. Shit. Huh. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Uh. Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <sighs> I'll pass. Pass. Oh. Uh huh. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Mehr kann ich hier nicht. Okay. <laughs> Einkaufswagen. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Nur Zwischenstation hier. Hm. Hm. Ein Campingstuhl. Wow. Empty. Mhm. What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. Hmm. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. <laughs> well, kind of. Kann mir das noch angucken? Das gönnen wir uns noch mal an. Ich glaube, da wird eh nichts Tolles drin sein. Nothing. Weniger als nichts, okay. 
Oh. Hätte sie noch ein bisschen Chili con carne drin. Just water. Ist in diesen Zeiten auch wertvoll auf jeden Fall. Ach ja, okay. Mm. Ja, muss ich jetzt hier irgendwas... Achso, ich habe noch nicht in das Zelt reingeguckt. Schon ein bisschen sass. Jesus, is a kid mixed up in this? Was more like. Yeah. Your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? Well, that's a hell of a question, mister. They told me I'd be safe with them. Men who lived here. But it weren't safe. Not for me. And not for my girl. They didn't treat her nice. Not at all. They took her away. Into the woods. Wouldn't tell me where. And I faked them. Every way I could think. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed them. And I'm staying here till she comes back to me. One way or another. She'll come back. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice, sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. You shot Mark, you psycho bitch. Who the fuck is Mark? I don't know any Mark. You shot him at the dairy. The fuck I did. That's them other people. These good buddies with your boyfriend here. I guess you met them. Ain't they nice? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Put down the crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I needed to kill you fuckers. <laughs> Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind. For oh. God damn it! You straight up murdered that woman. Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. Der Achievement Name. It's a clean shot though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? 
Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on Maria. Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, Princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? <sighs> yeah, you could say that. They don't exactly see eye to eye on how we should be doing things. Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Ha, okay. Äh, gut. Weiß nicht, wie wir mit allen Leuten quatschen. Hallo. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. Hmm. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. Psst. Typ wird langsam ein bisschen psycho, habe ich das Gefühl. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. You really like that gun. What's not to like? It's just a gun. That's where you're wrong. This is Charlotte. She's as faithful as a starving hound when you got a bone in your pocket. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. <lacht> ja, langsam wird er ein bisschen mir ein bisschen zu psycho, muss ich sagen. Irgendwas Spannendes hier, was er erzählt. All fixed. That should make everyone happy. Ja, ich würde auch gerne mal eine Runde schaukeln jetzt. Boah, ich hätte echt mal wieder Bock zu schaukeln, so ein echt. Und den Looping schaffen. Nee, aber. <lacht> Lange nicht mehr geschaukelt ist. Bin ich auch zu alt für. Darf ich nicht mehr. So, äh. Okay, Werkzeugkasten. Kann ich denn hier schönes machen? Moment, was, soll, was ist jetzt eigentlich meine Aufgabe? Soll ich irgendwann drüber reden? Ich weiß gar nicht. Eigentlich soll ich doch. Also, ich kann natürlich noch zu Clem gehen und dir die Mütze zurückgeben. Vielleicht habe ich ja irgendeine Nebenquest hier, wenn ich mit den Leuten nochmal rede oder so. Kann ich jetzt mal hier rein? Wahrscheinlich nicht. Oh doch. Cool. Oh, ich muss hier sogar rein. Damn, son. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay, go ahead. Whoa. Katja says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. Okay. Hut. Here, Clementine. My hat. You found it. I knew 
you'd find it. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Do you think you'll ever have kids? Mm. I don't think so, Clem. Not the way the world is now. I just... Uh, I don't think I could do that. Oh. Maybe when the world gets better, then. Maybe. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Ob ich sie nicht streicheln kann. She looks skinny. <lacht> sie hat ja auch gerade geworfen. Sagt man das so bei Clem? Like Wobei, das hat sie noch nicht, She's aber. Pretty. Hm. Cool. Have I missed anything? No, not really. Hm, it smells funny in here. Like manure. What's manure? Duty. <lacht> Ha, das Thema hatten wir schon mal. Fun, fun. Hm. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Um, when do you think uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <lacht> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. <lacht> ja, ja, viel zu sagen. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Thanks. Yep. Yep. Warum kann ich hier rein? <lacht> hier ist gar nichts. Wow. Ich muss mal ganz wichtiges klären. Kann ich den Leckstein lecken? Nee. Ich bin enttäuscht. Soll ich mal alles... Ich guck mal überall rein. Vielleicht ist irgendwo was Interessantes. Hallo Leckstein. Leckstein, Leckstein. Alles muss versteckt sein. I wanna play in the hay. Just stay close to your mom for now. Okay. Boah, diese so scheiß Kinder. Ich hasse Kinder. Äh, ja gut. Sonst ist ja auch nichts. Ich meine, warum sollte hier auch überhaupt irgendwas sein? Aber wenn ich alles untersuchen kann, dann tue ich das auch, ne? Aha. Das ist ja interessant hier. Empty. Empty. It's empty. Oh Gott. Okay, vielleicht gucke ich doch nicht überall rein. Wo ich hier nicht überall hin kann. Ah, da werde ich wahrscheinlich nicht raus können. Ich wusste nicht warum. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor, what you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Klug an die Sache rangehen. Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? No, why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Florida man, einfach. Hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly. 
have a peek inside and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right, sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Let's come. find this door, Andy. Just tools. We keep it locked so the people in the woods don't try and grab them. Uh, we'd be dead without them. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, Mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Einfach mal direkt konfront konfront konfrontieren. Lenke Andy ab, um ihn aus der Scheune zu locken. Aha. Ich dachte, wird mir eh nichts Spannendes erzählen. Lecke Andy ab. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Mhm. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Up something I think could help with the lock. All right, good to hear. Let's just try to see if it helps. Let's try it. Let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Toll. Here, what's this then? Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> Andy needs something again. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Is it really so doof, or or what's that so doof? Hmm. Ich sollte ihn schon auf lange Sicht ablenken, wahrscheinlich. Ich versuch's noch mal, aber wenn das wieder scheitert. Let's do this. Ja, okay. False alarm. I'm back. Okay, dann muss ich draußen wahrscheinlich irgendwas manipulieren oder so, damit er wirklich mal was zu tun hat. Ich könnte ja bei der Gelegenheit eigentlich noch mal eben mit den Leuten reden, ja. Mit den Peoples, ne? Mit den Party Peoples. Hier hinten, vor allem. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Hm. Ist das schon die Ablenkung, die wir benutzen können? Geh jetzt einfach zu Andy und sagen ihm: Hey, der alte Sack flirtet mit deiner Mom. Gefällt dir das? Du geile Sau. Geh da hin. Punkt. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? Uh. There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. Hmm. <laughs> the text passt auch gerade so rein. Uh... What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. After what Kenny told me? I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Das war nicht die klügste Reihenfolge, wie ich die, wie ich die Gesprächsoption hier ausgewählt habe, aber ist ja egal. Okay, muss ich jetzt noch irgendwas finden, ablenken? Wie machen wir das? Wir stellen wäre das an. Vielleicht den Generator manipulieren. Vielleicht ist das eine Sache. Äh, Moment, wo war? Achso. <lacht> Entschuldigung. Aber mal zertreten hier. Okay. Warte, 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 war
Something's always tripping the breaker. Ich wollte gerade das Ding da unten manipulieren noch. Da was konnte ich gerade da unten. Ach Mann. Ach Mann. Aber erstmal ausmachen, sonst sterbe ich dabei. Äh, aha. Das war vielleicht das. Das ist ein Multi-Tool, merke ich gerade. Ich dachte, das wäre so ein, so ein. Aber nur so eine Zange. Na dann. Ich will es eigentlich nicht durchschneiden, falls es diese Option gibt. Okay, gut. Ja, das ist ein bisschen Angst, dass es jetzt durchschneidet oder so. Fucking Danny, wo hast du das Ding gefunden? Oh, fucking Ding, through a belt. Damn it, Tom. Ah, son of a fuck. God, this will take forever. Ahem. Briefkasten. No mail coming in or out these days. At least they don't have to worry about bill collectors anymore. Ja, werden sie das gewusst? Nochmal einmal kurz vor der Apokalypse so richtig ausrasten. Alles kaufen. Boah, wenn so eine Apokalypse ausbrechen würde, ich wär, das würde erstmal in alle, keine Ahnung, zum Saturn gehen und Spiele und Filmregal plündern. <lacht> ah. Noch einmal was gönnen, noch einmal mir das angucken. Und dann sterben. Okay, dann wollen wir mal. Dann manipulieren wir mal, würde ich sagen. Manipulieren, ne, das haben wir ja schon. Dann knacken wir mal den Laden. Essen fassen. Mom, Dad, Dinner Time! It's Dinner Time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Ja, eigentlich ja perfekte Ablenkung jetzt. Da kann ich ganz entspannt mir hier einen abdrehen. Quietsch, 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 pling. Fang die doch auf, so findest du die doch nie wieder, wenn die da jetzt runterfallen. Haha, ah, wie wenn ich PC aufschraube. Jedes Mal verliere ich irgendeine Schraube und muss erstmal auf dem Boden suchen, wo sie ist. Es ist furchtbar. Und ich lerne nicht dazu. Ladies and gentlemen, Boy, we got them. The bell? Dinner time. What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. Oh, Brenda, you wow. are an angel. Oh, Excuse me, miss. We had to block the back door after Walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. Now go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Oh oh. Ihr wisst in welche Richtung das hier geht, oder? Walkers aren't getting through that thing. Achso, ich wollte mir das weiter angucken. 
Ganz wichtig. Hm. Die Wasser nicht aber bedienen jetzt. Ich will doch Sound anmachen, damit die denken, ich wasche mir die Hände und in Wahrheit gehe ich nach oben. First aid recently. Solltest du es nicht so langsam verstehen? Candles. Smart. What do they need so much morphine for? Hmm. Ich gehe mal sehr stark davon aus, dass die Tür drüben. What the hell? Ja, oder so. Kann ich die Tür wieder schließen? Ne, kann ich gar nicht. Ich kann keine Beweise vernichten. Okay. Das die, ich wollte gerade sagen, dass die Tür hier wahrscheinlich gar nicht offen wäre, aber... Ja. Aha. Where the hell is Mark? Thought Brenda said he was up here resting. Ach, Lee. Feels like there's a storm coming. Is that blood? Farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary <laughs> here. Hat man bestimmt nicht gehört unten. man did you find something oh sit your ass down lee this lady has made you a meal yeah lee what's gotten into you he just had a start he could use some goddamn manners you're eating human meat that's crazy what the no, hell i'm uh, scaring the kids lee lee what the hell is wrong with you don't indulge him lily there's always something with this guy Mom, I was eating that. Quiet. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We got to think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. You're all sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways. One way or another. 
like y'all. Clementine, run! Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black. Put fuck. your guns down. We're walking you out of here. Near my Mommy, fucking family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay. Lee? Lee? Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Hello, Mark. Yep. Open the goddamn door! You can't keep us in here! <coughs> Open up! I will tear you fuckers Stop apart with my bare hands! We gotta find another way out of here! <coughs> you shit <coughs> fucking bastards! Open this door, goddammit! I will knock the Please, goddamn Adam, door down! Stop. It was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet... Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. What happened? The man hit you. They threw us in the meat locker. Lee, we gotta get out of here. If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches. Get us out, you sons of bitches! Dad! This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Ah, soil and green is mentioned flesh. Okay. Mm. Please settle down! I'll, I'll rip your goddamn heads off uh, and make you swallow! Don't wanna know what kind. <laughs> Weiß ganz genau, welche, welches on, kind. Don't give up. We're gonna find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. There's Marvis on the way! Let us out now! Do you wanna live? That is not gonna help! Could there be a hole behind these pallets? No such luck. They're not gonna open the they door! They got caught you and duck, Lee! You're Those fuckers have my family! I know! We're gonna get out of here and find them! Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! Dad, this isn't helping! Come on, Larry. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah, I want to attract their attention. So I can fucking kill them! Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your problem? You were a prick back at the motor lodge, and you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. But guess what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn, I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. Dad! Open up, goddammit! I'm not your enemy, Larry. I don't believe you. Don't forget, I know who you really are. I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, <laughs> Easy! Uh, oh, God. Dad? <gasps> no! Dad, come on! Dad! God, he stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead. What has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! Good morning later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! 
God damn it, Kenny! He is not dead! Lily can still save him. I wish she could. Believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee! I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. Oh, God damn it. Wake up. Wake up! Come on! Uh, come. Is he breathing at all? No! No, I don't think so! Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! What? You're putting all of us at Two, risk, you son of a bitch! Three, You're fucking four. worthless, Lee. Er hat sich gerade bewegt. No! Kenny, I'm sorry. What the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! Are you okay? Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. Shh. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. Alter! <lacht> er hat sich gerade bewegt und dann matscht er einfach den Kopf weg. Ich, ich bezweifle, dass du so krass den Kopf wegmatscht mit so einem Ding. Ich glaube, so schwer sind diese Salzstab. Oder? Also, die sind wahrscheinlich schon schwer, aber glaube nicht. Also, dass du vielleicht schon stirbst, wenn du das Ding voll in die Fresse haust, okay. Aber dass dein Gesicht einfach pulverisiert wird, das zweifle ich so ein bisschen an. Aber. Ich, ich bin ja kein Experte oder sowas. Muss ich meine Mutter mal fragen, die können das vielleicht besser. I'm sorry. Schön, wie er einmal rumgeht. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. Hm. You have to think about saving your own life now. It's what he would have wanted. Yeah, probably. Ay, ay, ay. I don't want to hear mehr? it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. You talk a big game, but could you do the hard thing if it was Katja or Dust? It's never gonna come to that. Not if I have anything to do with it. For all we know, the St. John's might have... No! They, they need Katja, remember? She's the whole reason they brought us here. And no doubt they're using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta get to him. That's all. Mm hmm, tatsächlich ein Punkt auf jeden Fall. Look, if we're gonna survive this shit, we've got to work together. How do you expect Lily to work with us after what she just saw you do? If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. What now? What? You don't want to hang me up on a meat hook and leave me to rot? What I want isn't important. What I know is their safety in numbers. You got any ideas? The air conditioner. Yeah, that's where I say I'm next guest gewesen here. Uh, oh, falsche Richtung, Entschuldigung. Here is this thing. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Ich weiß genau wer. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. 
Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Mm-mm. Hmm. It's not coming off that way. Huh. Hat hier jemand eine Münze zufällig? Listen, I need a coin or something. It's important. It could get us out of here. Well, I got nothing. Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but back at the motor end, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. Do what you have to do. yoo -hoo! Looting! Oh, boy. <laughs> Any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Ja, Alter, schön in den Eiern. Hundertprozentig da hinten. Huh, he still carried his wallet. Ja, genau in der Tasche habe ich mein Portemonnaie auch immer. Falls ihr mich mal ausrauben wollt, wisst ihr, wo es am besten geht. Hä, habe ich jetzt nicht? Achso, oder. Nicht im Portemonnaie. Don't worry, I'm not taking it. Here we go. Two quarters. And a dime. Okay. Versuchen wir es. Remove these screws and get this unit off. Yo. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. I know you're brave enough. I'm scared. Remember the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. I do when I get out. See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Also die anderen würden hier glaube ich auch easy durchpassen, aber gut. I 
told you there was something up with this room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. Boah. Schon mal nicht verkehrt. Da ist Clementine gerade durch. Naja, ach du, was sie schon gesehen hat. Gut. Ja. Moment. Oh, Taser. Nett. Oh. Okay, was von beiden nehmen wir? Der Taser schaltet die auf jeden Fall temporär aus. Damit können sie... Ne, ich nehme den Taser. <lacht> ich analysiere nicht. Ich nehme den Taser. Ja gut. Ei, 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 okay, die müssen wir haben. Ich muss niesen. Ist gerade sehr antiklimaktisch, ich weiß. Oh, jetzt kommt's nicht. Was machst du da außerhalb der Bar? Oh shit, just guarding the place, like you said. Kann ich gerade reden? Okay, so schnell war ich nicht. Ähm. So viel zu auf das Zeichen warten. Hey, ist aber doch scheiße. Oh, sweet revenge. I should fucking kill you right now. Hmm. Mark never volunteered to be food! You gotta keep me alive! If you kill me, the meat gets tainted! You can't eat it! You're already tainted! You ain't gonna kill me! Just like you didn't kill Jolene! You don't have what it takes! <laughs> fucking coward! This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you. Go. I'll cover you. Just stay here and keep Clementine safe. I'll be right back.
Kitty! Hmm. Too long. We need your help. Yeah, when you guys didn't come back, I figured something was up. What can we do? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed him to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Doc and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kitty is. All right, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kitty. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. <lacht> Stimmt, die haben ja gar nichts davon mitgekriegt. Wo waren die eigentlich die ganze Zeit? Die haben gesagt, dass sie irgendwo hin wollten. Ich hatte verstanden, dass die die anderen holen wollten. Aber das scheint ja nicht der Fall zu sein, weil die anderen natürlich viel schneller da waren. Na, keine Ahnung, was die gemacht haben. Dann waren die noch dabei, das Lager irgendwie zu looten, also und das Hotel noch irgendwie aufzuräumen, alles mitzunehmen. <lacht> ja klappen können. <lacht> ja. Aber meine Stimme ist einfach zu schwarz. Ich eine Phase. Go, Brenda. Lee, Lee, don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Ganz ruhig. Stop right there. I mean it. Think about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Dramatisch hoch. Stay back! Guck mal. Don't do anything! No! I told you to stop! I told you! <lacht> Sie hat's mir gesagt, ja? Ja, gebe ich zu. Aua. Ich hab gesehen, was da gerade war, ne? Go, Brenda! Mark kann uns doch ein letztes Mal behilflich sein. Ich auch nicht. Please don't make this any worse. Just stop. Das ist noch nicht reicht. Look at what you've done! You 
brought this on yourself. No, uh-uh, you did this. All we wanted was a little gas to keep ourselves safe. Away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee! War so vielversprechend. Hey Lee, I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yeah, they were. That is sick. God, just... Ugh. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? She's not stupid, Carly. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. <sighs> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hon, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. 
For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? <laughs> das ist ja alles hier irgendwie ein bisschen. You know, Hero. You destroyed two lives in that meat locker. Kenny, you're not a bad man, but fuck. What the hell are we gonna do now? Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, are those bad people dead? We didn't kill them, so I don't know. They might have been able to get away from the walkers, but I'm sure they won't be coming after us. That's good. Hey, Dad, what's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God, not more strangers. Don't shoot! We're here to help! Das Auto. Ich erinnere mich. Huh. <lacht> Man kann nicht langsam laufen übrigens. Ich kann nur so... Ne? Figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. But what if it's not? Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? <sighs> Fucking Clementine. You're right. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. Clementine and I don't want any part of this. We're starving. Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Okay, what have we got in here? Look, there's more food in that box. They have antibiotics. What else do they have? See if there's any water. Here. <laughs> got it? Yeah, I got it. Lee, there's a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna want to see this. Shit. Jake, Bart, Linda, and all y'all fucking sickos from the save lots. They came. 
call y'all bandits, but you're fucking right. Oh, darling, baby, look at you. Look at you. Oh, you need a mama, sweetheart. We won't let them bandits get you, will we? No. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find thinking it, I'll you're safe. You know. Sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you gotta be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. People who took. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise. This place is done. It's time to move on. Screw it. Not like you ever listen to a damned word I say. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phases in it, but it's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! <laughs> Oh, <lacht> da habe ich ja, äh, das sind ja interessante Statistiken. David ist Bein abgehakt, yes. Jolene erschossen, nope. Äh, Pragmatismus, geholfen Larry zu töten, nee. <lacht> beide sind schon Brüder umgebracht, nicht beide Brüder getötet. Ja, eigentlich kriegen wir ja noch beide, oder eine halt ein bisschen... Unter Druck, aber naja. Äh, und tatsächlich, Lebensmittel haben die meisten gestohlen. Ich hätte es wahrscheinlich auch gemacht, wenn Clementine da nicht so rumgemeckert hätte. Aber ich will ja ein gutes Vorbild sein, ne? Äh, ja, passt schon. Credits! Mini-Credits. Hunger und Hilfe. Ja, das war die zweite Episode. Mein Gott, die Episoden dauern doch ein bisschen länger, als ich dachte, ne? Jetzt so in hier zwei Stunden 18. Ich meine, ist ja vollkommen fein, ich habe Zeit. Aber, äh, ne? Ich bin gespannt, ob die auch so lange bleiben. Ja, äh, das ist auf jeden Fall das Kapitel des Spiels, an das ich mich noch am besten erinnern konnte. Ich muss zugeben, ich weiß jetzt auch wirklich gar nicht mehr so genau, was jetzt eigentlich so in den nächsten Kapiteln, also in den nächsten Episoden noch so passieren wird. Ich bin sehr vergesslich. Aber diese, diese ganze Kannibalengeschichte, die, die, die hatte ich noch im Kopf. Ich wusste jetzt nicht mehr genau, welche Episode, aber auf jeden Fall, ja. Ich habe es damals auf jeden Fall nicht kommen sehen. Ähm, ich habe es ja, wie gesagt, zusammen mit einem Kumpel gespielt. Wir haben das beide nicht kommen sehen. Und das ist halt ganz witzig, weil ich wusste das noch, aber es gibt halt wirklich viele Hinweise, äh, die man eigentlich, ja, schon identifizieren kann. Allein die Mutti da eben, ne, die ja wirklich erschossen wurde, genau in dem Moment, als sie gerade erzählen wollte, was äh, die St. Johns da eigentlich für Scheiße abziehen. Äh, aber ja, äh, lustig. Mary Winter is coming Stark. Wirklich echt jetzt, weil sie Stark mit Nachnamen heißt, hat sie wahrscheinlich darauf bestanden, dass da doch bitte... Aua. Und das Coming steht. Aua, ich hab Aua. Scheiße. Ich habe mich vorhin geschnitten am Papier. Ätzendste der Art, sich zu schneiden. Ich habe es gerade vergessen und ich bin gerade mit meinem. Ah, I. Oh, ich bin gerade mit meinem Finger so einmal über, mein, über meine Socke tatsächlich. Ja, ich sitze hier gerade im Schneider, sitze ich so einmal über meine Socke und. Ah, ich glaube, es ist gerade wieder aufgegangen. Aua. <lacht> Scheiße. Gleich jetzt noch Pflaster rüber machen. Ja, ähm. Gut, was kann ich sonst noch sagen? Ähm. Hat mir wieder sehr viel Spaß gemacht. Äh, ich bin erstaunt darüber. Ähm, Gerade jetzt am Ende der Kampf gegen, gegen, also da im Regen und so, wie gut das Spiel auch inszeniert ist, obwohl es halt ein Telltale-Spiel ist, sage ich mal ganz fies. Weil ich habe das Gefühl, dass die Telltale-Spiele immer nicht so viel Budget haben. So die ganzen Animationen und so. Ja, ne? Die sind halt meistens so mittelprächtig und hier ist es echt wieder aufgegangen. Aua, es tut voll weh gerade. Die sind meistens halt immer so eher mittelprächtig. <lacht> Aber am Ende, also so Inszenierung, das können die mitunter. Ja, übrigens, ne, ich kann mal hier zeigen, äh, nicht das. Ich benutze gerade die Maus. 
Äh, ich habe mir jetzt 400 Jays gekauft. Geil, ne? Schön MMOGA, Code für 1,49. Das war eine Investition. Ja, äh, dann sagen wir auf jeden Fall danke fürs Zusehen. Ich hoffe, es gefallen. Und wir sehen uns das nächste Mal. Genau hier wieder bei Episode 3 von The Walking Dead. Wir können ja schon mal... Und jetzt hier gucken, wie die heißt. Der lange Weg. Achso, das hatten wir ja schon den Namen. <lacht> Stimmt. Ja, gut. Äh, danke fürs Zusehen und bis zum nächsten Mal. Ciao!